This is a baitcast reel. This is a spinning reel. Um, now, the spinning reels, they work uh, pretty good. They do. I don't mind using them. Um, you know, this this is the first year I've used the bait cast reels. And uh, the first time I used the bait cast reel was couple weeks ago actually and uh, you know it's actually it's kind of nerve-wracking but at first but you know the bird's nest really aren't that bad and after you use it a little while you get used to how you're doing it and now I don't even have to think um, to put my thumb on the spool to stop it when the lure hits the water I don't even have to think about that anymore um, and it casts so much farther um, now the difference is in between the uh, bait cast rods like you see the eyes you see how the eye this is the bottom eye of the bait cast rod this is the bottom eye of the spinning rod see there is a size difference now this spinning rod I've had it for around 18 years so it's probably about time to get a new one but oh well but the uh, the bait cast rods have a much smaller eye okay they are designed to be put on the back to where the eyes are facing up like this okay the eyes are facing up now with the spinning rods the eyes face down and um, I think I think it's like the pull is uh, designed for the bait cast rods it's designed to be stiffer and heavier action like this rather than this and the spinning rods they're designed to be used like this rather than this so that's uh, the main difference and then another big big difference is on the bait cast rods you have you see this little uh, I don't know what they call it that little thumb guard or finger guard or whatever but see when you cast it out you just put your finger down there like that now the spinning rods they don't have one so oh well but uh on the bait cast rod see this is the uh, magnetic brake and this little knob where is it over here right there at my thumb that's the knob you turn the knob and it's uh, supposed to be another kind of brake or stiffen to allow the spool to not spin as fast um it's uh it's really not that bad using it and after you get used to it um the bird's nests aren't that bad and you know you just gotta practice at it and just practice makes perfect and stick with it and that's about it's it. really not bad getting a bird's nest either I mean, you just pull the line out like this. See that? You just pull it out. Keep your thumb on the spool in order to slow it down. And then you just pull. Uh, this. And then, then you have to put it back on. 
the spool. So you just hold it like this and then uh, reel. It's really not bad. I've, I think I've lost two fish doing that though. I had two fish on but I had a bird's nest and I lost them because of it. I'm getting uh, a lot better using the bait caster. I mean, I can cast it further now. I'm getting a lot less bird nests. Um, it's just overall, it's easier to use. It's faster to uh, to use too, and. It's just overall, it's just better.